In this video, you'll see a workout using the Instar 3.0 workout system. You'll get to see firsthand the usefulness of the system, the time it takes between transitions, the pieces used or not used, and you'll get to see a little bit of workout planning with it. The idea is to help you decide whether it's worth it for you to drop $200 on the workout system and whether it will suit your needs. For my quarantine workout here, I've adapted Jim Stepani's Shortcut to Size program to work with my equipment. I also have some different types of bands, a TRX and a jump rope. I do wish I had a sandbag. Here, I superset the exercises using the ab exercises and some personal shoulder rehab scapula exercises as my rest for the back and bicep work. The system cost $168 on Amazon Prime. The benefits are I was able to take it with me for van life. It's easy to travel with. You can pack it up in a suitcase pretty easy. It packs small and the bands are protected which is kind of a big deal. The downsides are it's not as simple as adding more plates to find your max weight for these exercises and having to adjust the position every time. That said, uh, you can adjust these exercises mid-exercise as needed just by moving further away from the anchor point. Band workouts in general, it's a benefit for bicep curls because you get the most tension at the top of the exercise where you're strongest but at the same time, it's not as great for bench press, where at your full extension, it's the hardest and where you want to have a lot of tension at the start of the muscular extension, you don't have as much. Coming up, you'll see the most time-consuming transition. I detached the bar from the door anchors and had to adjust the number of bands and then ultimately use alternate bands to get to the right weight for 12 reps. Before I got this, I priced out creating a DIY version of this kit, and ultimately it cost about the same without the same safety features, and it would have increased transition time between exercises, which was the most important decision factor for me in ultimately getting the Instar. For this trip, I opted not to pack the bench press strap. I just didn't think it was worth the wait. I haven't figured out a way to get maximum value out of it. I also didn't pack the ankle straps since the foot straps can serve the same purpose as those. It's worth highlighting that depending on what you wanna do, this is not the be all end all system for you. It's worth having other tools in your toolkit to use to achieve the goals that you want. I'm very grateful I got this system. It was really useful on the road. And now that I'm in quarantine, it's fantastic to have something that allows me to have a system every single day to get my workout in. As I go forward, I will probably create a specific workout based on the exercises that are best suited for these bands, as opposed to adapting uh, Jim Stepani's workouts to these bands. Anyways, I hope that this has been very useful for you. If you're going into quarantine, I hope that you have everything you need to crush some workouts while you have the time.